everyone, today I'm going to be styling my tapered cut um, with a twist out, which is one of my first ones. Okay, so we're going to go ahead and get started. I have my water bottle. Um, I'm using my Design Essentials um, Avocado Curling Cream. And I'm also going to be using the main choice um, 24 karat glycerin gold twist and gel. Um, so let's get right to it. Okay, here I am sectioning off the shorter hair um, away from the longer hair so that I can twist the longer hair um, for this twist out style. Okay, so as you can see here, I am sectioning off a section um, from that middle part. I am detangling that section with my demon brush. Then I'm spraying this section with some water to define the curls. Adding some of that wild growth oil. Then I'm going to add some of the gold glistening gel um, to define the curls as well. You also want to make sure that this section is detangled thoroughly. Um, so that the twist will be um, defined. Now I am just twisting um, that section. And as you can see, I am detangling so much um, so that my twist can be smooth. And if I do feel a little lumps in my twist, I then go in with a comb um, to smooth those kinks out um, of that section of those twists while I am twisting. Okay, here I am sectioning off um, another section of hair. And I'm going to follow the same steps. I'm going to spray it with some warm water. Um, add some more of the Design Essentials um, Twisting Cream. Some of the Wild Growth Oil. And some of the 24 Karat um, Glistening Gel. Um, and I'm going to make sure that the hair is detangled and twist away. Wild 
Agro Falls. This is like my second time using it, and I love the um, shine that it leaves my hair with. Okay, so my hair is kind of in a mohawk. As you can see in the back, I have this um, twist up and then I'm going to finger curl this part. And also I'm going to finger curl um, the opposite side on this side. So um, I'm just going to use um, my spray bottle. Put some of that curling cream on. Some of that wild growth oil and then use some of the twisted gel. Finally all done twisting my hair and finger coiling the sides and the back I just um, sprayed it with the water the gel the cream and the oil and I just um, used um, raking the raking me method finger raking my hair um, just for the back so now what I'm going to do is I'm going to go and sit under my dryer um, my hair is kind of thick and I use a lot of products so it could take maybe an hour or so um, just to dry my hair. Once it's all dry, we'll, I'll come back to you guys with the um, untwisting of the twist. Okay, so right here I am taking my diffuser and I'm going to um, diffuse that back section where I did the um, hand raking method. Um, just because like I said my hair is thick and it takes so long to dry um, just to cut down on the drying time okay so it is the next morning what I did was I sat under my dryer for one hour and I just slept on it overnight and now I'm going to um, untwist it As you can see they are really dry and I put some pine rods on the ends of these two because it wasn't giving me that cool that I wanted. Okay, so what I'm gonna do is just coat my fingers um, with some oil so it can minimize frizz as I take out the twist. All right, so I just separate the twist where they um, naturally separate. All of the twists are out and separated. So now for this back section, um, it's kind of matted from me laying on it overnight. So what I'm gonna do is just get my um, spray bottle of water and just spray it to just activate that gel. Not much. The 
I'm gonna add some oil. Then I'm going to get my pit. And I have learned that using plastic pits just don't work um, for my hair. Um, it gives you a lot of free frizz. So I'm gonna use um, this stainless steel pit and I'm just going to lift my root. Keep in mind, I'm just doing the roots because if I pull it through all the way, it's going to disturb the curls. No picking that I'm going to do since this is um, day one hair. I like to just pick it out a little at the root and then it will lift on its own as the days go by. Oops, I forgot the twist. Okay. So this is the final result. Um, I hope you enjoyed this and I'll be back with more tutorials. Bye.